Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, I'm going to go through uh, how you can set up a, a Google My Business page on uh, Google. So what is a Google My Business page? So it, it's a place where you can engage with customers on Google for free. Uh, you can get more than a business listing. Your free business profile lets you easily connect with customers across Google search and maps. So I'll give you an example. This, so this is what it looks like once you've completed it on the mobile phone. Can you see here, it's got all the details on here. It all will have um, an address and stuff like that. So if you've got a call, um, a phone number, where are you, to the directions, if people want to message you on websites, so and this is completely free. Um, so I'm going to show you onto it uh, on an internet browser as well, on your laptop and how it looks. So right here, and so can you see in the right here? So this is just a random place that I put in Tal Mania. Uh, and on the right here, this is your Google My Business. Can you see? And you can do all sorts of stuff with it. Yeah, that's what it is. What else can you do with it? So I'll go through this now. Um, so you can get customers with a business profile. You can post photos and offers to your profile to show what makes your business unique. And give customers reasons to choose you every time. So when they put, you know, um, tile place near me, and if you're close to that customer, your listing may come up. Um, what I say may because there's obviously other people in the market as well uh, or, or organizations uh, so give customers more ways to reach you so your customers are ready to connect by calling messaging or leaving reviews now with more ways to transact you can do more business and with more people doing business online it's a no-brainer to get that a profile a business profile um, find out how many people are connected with you on Google. So whoever's coming from Google, you can obviously track that as well within that. So like, like an analytics. So yeah, so that's the kind of overview. So what I'm going to do, go ahead and start managing a business. Or I'm just going to put random details in just to show you how to, to, to do it. First of all, you need a Google account um, to be able to get onto Google My Business. So either you can put, either if you've got an email address already set up or a phone number or anything like that, you can put that in here. I've got an email that I've put in. Um, and then uh, what I'll do, I'll ask you for your password. So you're logging in basically. If you haven't got one, you can create a Google account at the bottom here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put my details in and I'll see you. Right, so here's the next page. Once I've signed in, it's come onto this page. Find and manage your business. What I'm going to do is add your business to Google. If it's already there, you can type your details and claim it if you wanted to. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to add my business. Uh, or click here where it says add your business to Google. I'm just going to put any name in just for the sake of this video. Um, do. That. Yeah, let's do that. LTD. Yep, so I'll do that LDT uh, limited um, just for the sake of the video. So I'm going to click, click next. The next bit is do you want to add a location customers can visit, like a store or office? This location will show up on Google Maps and search when customers are looking for your business. So I'm gonna click yes, which means it's gonna ask for an address. So make sure you have an address handy for your business. So I'm gonna put these details in here. Um, for the address and stuff like that, just, just a random address. I'm going to put. 
So what's I click next? If that's me, um, you know, is it any of these? No, it isn't because it's never been registered. So we we'll do that. So the next bit is where are you located? So this is the Google Map. So what you can do here is drag and zoom the map, um, and position the marker to exact to the exact spot where your business is located. So look, can you zoom in and out? If I plus it, minus it here, and then I can drag this around. If I drag this wherever, yeah, you see? Then I can just click the next button. If you zoom in, you can get spots wherever it is. So you just zoom in again. Yeah, so there's a building there. I just put it wherever it is. That's fine. So I'm going to click next. That's accepted it. So it says, do you also serve customers outside this location? For example, if you visit or deliver to your customers, you can let them know where you're willing to go. So I'm going to write, uh, yes, I do serve customers out, outside my uh, location. Um, I'm just going to put any random place. So I was doing, I think it's in Ashton. So I'm going to put Tameside. Um, and then click OK. That's where it is. So if you deliver anywhere else, you can put now um, Manchester. That will come up, um, so whatever you put in, you know, as a location where you deliver, um, you, can, you can put them in. So next bit, what contact details do you want to show to customers? So help customers get by including this information on your listing. It's optional, so it's up to you. I would say if you've got any business details where customers can contact you, put it on there. If you've got a business URL, um, uh, something like that, then that will be good to put on there. And it says get a free website based on your information. You can also get a free website by Google as well. Uh, get a complete website with just a click. It's automatically built and updated based on your Google My Business listing also free you can also do this at a later time if you've got the time to do it now do it if not but for the for the sake of this video i'm not going to do it right now uh, but if you want me to do it hit down the comments below and, and i'll do another video just uh, around developing the, uh, the website uh, which is within the google my business page i can show you but for now for this video i'm going to move on and say uh, i don't i don't need a website So staying to know, what updates and recommendations for your business on Google? Yeah, the recommendations will be good. So I'm going to click yes, and then click next. So there we are. So finished. So I finished and the, the Google My Business um, setup. So um, I'm going to click finish here. So it said you'll be able to manage and do that thing um, on Google. Promote your business with photos and posts. Uh, track business analytics to understand your customers and respond to customer reviews. Fantastic. So I'm going to click finish. So that's talking about add your hours. Um, so I'm going to write Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Opens at no, um, 9 till 5. Yep, then I'll do the same. Just, you can do the same for all the rest of them as well. So your opening times. Um, yeah. 
then you know, click save. So I'm going to skip it for now. Add messaging. Let customers message your business on Google for free. Yeah, I'm going to save that. So, almost, so the next bit it asked me about adding messaging. Let uh, customers message your business on Google for free. So I'm going to set that up later. But if you want to, you can accept messages. And click save. I'm going to skip that for now. Add business descriptions. Um, so here is where you're going to add a uh, description about your business. Uh, let customers find out more about your business. So. I am a online clothing uh, or I'm a, a bathroom anything anything that you can put in here, whatever describes your business and then click save. Now, um, and here you can add your photos, so whatever photos you want. So it's giving you some examples. So, can you see examples of a, a, a shop, uh, candles, whatever you're doing? You can show off your products and let customers keep inside your business, okay? And then you put whatever your photos you attach, then you click. Asking about claiming your credit, start advertising on Google. For now, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna do it at a later time. But if you wanted to claim the credit, you can do. So I'm gonna click. As um, your business profile is almost ready, you can continue making updates at your profile at any time. And once I press continue, it's gonna let me do it any time. So I can change things about, um, so, which is great. Made any mistakes, you can always go back to it and rectify the mistakes. So, here we are, guys. So, now it's created a profile uh, for Google My Business linked to my Google email account. So, here we are. So, can you see? Um, you got Google My Business page. So here's the home. So this is all the home place. You see, keep customers update, answer a few questions. You can set that up, create a post, add photos, create an ad. Um, you know, you can claim uh, 80 pounds of the advertising credit. You can do that. So if you missed it before, you can come back into here. Um, get your first review, so share review form with people, uh, and so people can review what, your business. Um, get custom emails if you want to do that. Hope oh, you know you'll have to pay for it, but you can do that. Uh, have news and share with customers. Add a manager, to add a manager to your business. So if you need to uh, get somebody else to manage your profile, you can send an invite so people somebody else can manage it. Um, you, uh, so here your you can view how your business looks I'm gonna click this and see how our business uh, looks on Google so to view a map you can open the link so, so here you go so as I set up before so this is how it looks on the Google map just to show you guys details comes on the left hand side here Obviously, it's not fully filled out, but once it's fully filled out, then it will give you more more information, um, hours and all that kind of stuff, um, you know, the website, etc. But here's the location where I put before the way I set it up before, so which is great. It's sorted that out. Um, the next one, and we'll look at view on search. How does it look on search, you know, in Google search? So here you go. So do that limited. Um, this is how it's going to look on the right hand side. When somebody put, 
can you know close in retail nearby me within a certain area is close to my uh, business then uh, it's going to come up on the right here so all the information that i put in as i set it up right here and then people get into it you see it's amazing it's set up um, Um, so obviously I have, I've got a lot of work to do on the profile so here it gives you hints what you need to do so which is helpful anything that, that, that we missed in the video uh, or I missed I can go back to it and then I can I can I can um, add it on afterwards um, and then uh, pending edits if you want a Google virtual so there's loads of things that you can do with it so I would say spend some time um, looking at what else you, what you got on the left hand side here is uh, a menu so you can go down so if you click posts you can create a new post um, info um, info edit the info that I put in earlier if, like I said if you made any mistakes or anything like that you can you can edit uh, your info here can you see and more stuff as well um, google assist calls and messaging and that kind of stuff and opening time add photos along the left here there's insights as well so this is where you can see what customers have come in obviously it's a new uh, account so i can't do much with it because there's no customers that have come to it but here you should be able to see the data or select the time so how customers search for your business here promote your business so if you want to promote it you paid advertisement um customer actions what what actions did they take and uh, directions requests so if they click the directions button on the listing to find out where your place is it'll show you here phone calls when and how many times customers call your business uh the times so they give you data around that so how many people looked at your photos so it's amazing the information you get and then you can tweak your profile based on you know what customers do most which is amazing on the left also we've got reviews so this is customer reviews remember before i said you can share a phone with customers and all that kind of stuff uh, to get people to review which is amazing um, and look there messages so um, answer customer questions in the snap so you can do that um, let customers message you uh, provide quick answers to get your business um, questions go straight to your phone without revealing your number which is amazing so you can set that up as well photos that uh, will be here so you can add the photos there um, and this is where they'll come up here and then you got view, overview, video, images you added, interior, exterior, product so this is about if you get any premises this is about the outside, exterior, inside, so inside, outside, product, your team etc. all of that so this is about the products that you've got so uh, you can add um, get customers to your store, add products to your business profile and show what you have in stock so you can set that up. Um, and then, um, this is the website bit. So like I said earlier, it's going to pull um, your website information from what you put in. So it's already done it. You can tell the story and then you can publish it. So, what it so this is the website. It's, I'm not even doing anything with it. I just click the button and it's developed a website with information that I've put on so can you see that's how my website will look you can mess around with that um, let me know if you want me to do another video around messing around with the website and showing you how to edit things and put things on and all that kind of stuff but you see the reviews here as well I can do a separate uh, website um, video I don't want to um, 
you don't get this video too long. Uh, anyway, so can you see? You my business is here. Then if you've got all you've put into the, the website, the address, business hours, all that kind of stuff. So we can we can do that if you wanted to. You can click publish. Let's just see how that looks. Call it without me editing anything. This is how the website will look. Not having anything to having fun thing is great. So here we go. It's not got a, a, a domain name, but you can purchase one if you wanted to. Uh, but if you don't want to spend money yet, then you can just leave it as that. Yep. Amazing. So here, like here, you can say you can buy a domain name. If it's like pounds or something like that. Yeah. I'll close this for now. Here we go. And then users. Here's where if you want to add more people, you can add more users, you can manage the Google My Business account, which is good as well. So if you want to give it over to somebody else, and then what you've got is you create an ad. So if you want to put new paid advertisement, um, get a custom URL. So you know if you want to. URL, uh, Gmail, uh, email address. If you, get that, you can add a new business to your profile. So if you've got another business that you run and you want to set something up, you can click that. Um, and businesses, and there's extra and other information is at the bottom. Um, and you've got the top here, uh, website tips, and you can share websites as well. So that's it. I'm gonna finish the video now because uh, it is getting a bit long but yeah uh, please if you've got uh, any questions put them in the comments below uh, if you want me to do a video on another area of this um, you know like say with the website uh, please comment below if you want me to do that uh, I'll make another video around that uh, um, make sure you like Subscribe to my channel for more videos um, Share with your family and friends. I hope you found this useful uh, Please comment below how you found it. That'd be great. Just give us some feedback uh, So I can continue to make more videos and that motivate me to make more videos um, Thank you guys Bye